configure and verify eBGP objectives. Uh, addressing table. Acme one router. This router. Uh, other C01. This another router. ISP entry one. ISP entry two. On this section. PC. Two laptops and server. Configure eBGP in Acme because the ISP is using BGP as the routing protocol. You must configure Acme One, which is the Acme border router, to establish BGP network connection with ISP Entry One. ISP Entry One is the ISP border router that is directly connected to Acme. From ISP Entry One. Verify that the ISP has provided IP reachability through its network by pinning 1119, which is the IP address of the ISP entry to serial 00 interface. Okay, from ISP entry 1, ping serial, uh, ping, uh, serial 00 interface on ISP entry 2. Okay, ISP entry to serial zero, zero, one, 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 nine. Okay, go to ISP entry one. Enter ping one, 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 nine. Success. Um, from any device inside of Agma network, ping the other company server at 172.16.10.2. The server 172.16.10.2. Okay, go for example PC0 and common prompt ping 172.16.10.2. Destination host unreachable. Request timeout. These pings should fail because no BGP routing is configured at this time. Configure ACME1 to become an eBGP peer with ISP entry 1. ACME has an autonomous system number of 65001 and the ISP using autonomous system number 65003. Use 1111 as the name for IP address and add the ACME internal network 192.168.0.0.24 to BGP. Okay, go to ACME1. Enter. Enable configure terminal. ACME has autonomous system. 65,001 65,001 Router BGP 65,001 Enter Use 1111 as the name for IP address Okay, 1111 is the IP address of serial 000 on ISP entry 1. This IP. This IP is the name for the IP address of serial 000. Okay, this is the name for ACME. Okay. Name for 1111. And the remote autonomous system for ISP is 65003. Okay, the remote autonomous system is 65,003. Remote dash autonomous system, 65,003, enter. Okay, and this is the neighbor adjacency. Very good, because entry one is already configured. And internal network 192.168.0024. Okay, the internal network for ACME on gigabit 0192.168. That network. Okay, 
the network on gigabit zero zero network one eight two one sixty eight zero zero and the mask two fifty five two fifty five two fifty five zero enter and exit from any device inside of Agma Network Ping, the other company internal server again, does it work? Okay, go to PC0 and ping again to the server 172.16.2. Destination host unreachable. Okay. So you need to configure EBGP for other company. Configure rather other company one to form a uh, EBGP adjacency with ISP entry two. Okay, configure this router other company one. Okay, click here. Okay, ISP entry two, which is the ISP border router facing other company one. Other company is under autonomous system 6002 while ISP is under autonomous system 6003. Use the 1119 as the name or IP address of the ISP entry to and add the company internal network 172.16.10.0.24 to BGP. Okay, enter enable the field terminal router BGP. Okay, the autonomous system for other company is is sixty five thousand two. Sixty five thousand two. Enter. Okay, uh, sixty five thousand two. And the ISP is under autonomous system sixty five thousand three. Use one 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 nine as the name for IP address. Network 1119. Okay, 1119 is the serial 00 interface, the IP address of serial 00 interface on ISP entry 2. This interface, serial 000 on ISP entry 2, is the network of other company 1. Okay. And the remote autonomous system is 65003. 65,003. Enter. Very good. The night for adjacency because ISP entry 2 is already configured and internal network 172.16.10.0.24. The internal network for gigabit 00, zero on other company 1 network 172.16.10.0.24. Mask 55 to 55 to 55 0. Exit. Verify ACME 1 has former EPGP adjacency with ISP entry 1. Okay, go to ACME. Exit. Show IP BGP summary. Enter. Okay, BGP. BGP. Okay, there is an I for one 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 that is uh, ISP entry one. Okay, one 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 ISP entry one. Okay, use uh, show IP BGP summary command to verify the routes that ACME one has learned via EBGP and their status. Okay, uh, five network entries, five path entries, four three BGP path, best path, attribute entries, two BGP autonomous system path entries. And look at the routing tables on ACME1 and other company one. Okay, on ACME1 routing table, show IP routes. And you can see two directly connected networks with BGP 1114 1114 is this network serial 001 on ISP entry 1 
this this network the link between ISP entry one and ISP entry two one 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 eight is this uh, serial zero zero on ISP entry two this this network this link between ISP entry two and other company and 172.16.10.0 is the subnet, the network for the server. So it's very good. Okay, three BGP best path. Three BGP best path. And two BGP autonomous systems. Two BGP autonomous systems. Open a web browser in ACME uh, and device and navigate to other company server entering IP address 172.16.10.2. Okay, go to PC0, web browser 172.16.10.2. Success. Uh, ping. Command prompt ping the server 172.16.10.2 success. Completion 100%. Thank you very much.